Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming at y'all with a new hair video and I'm collaborating with I See Hair. Y'all know how the drill goes. They sent me over a nice wig. Ooh, look at that wig. They sent me the wig and they did send me some cute little, you know, pieces to go with it to make my process a lot easier. This is the Burgundy 99J Body Wave Lace Front Wig. Um, it's in 26 inches and baby, let me tell you, this is one of the best wigs I have ever had for so many reasons. One being this lace was so easy to work with. Oh my God, it was so easy to work with. And I did not have to dye this hair myself. It came with the color. It came like the perfect, like everything. It was just so easy of a process i would really recommend this to all of my beginners that have not really been wearing their frontals that long and need like a, a easy process but still want that customized look with the color then that is the this is the route for you okay so as you guys did just see i did do a different method than what i usually do when i pluck my wigs i used the arrogant tay method where he uses the towel and he plucks it that way that way you can get a real good payoff with, you know being able to see where you're plucking at how much more you need to do i watched that video a thousand times because it was so informational it helped so much so yeah right here i've got the wig pretty flat I've, you know uh dried it and went ahead and straightened it but he also showed how to pluck your parts make a perfect part um there is like a spray method you can do to kind of even you know perfect it even more but i think with this color i didn't want it to be too perfect i the whole look really not even about the color this whole look i wanted it to be more like natural but still perfect but i didn't want that perfect part i think sometimes it depends on the type of look you're going for but look at that part it's looking so much better um but yeah he that that video i learned so much um i'm gonna do another video on how i get my baby hairs the way he i see he does now i'm just so obsessed with him i got these tweezers um because he uses this brand of tweezers tweezer man tweezers they are so much better than the tweezers i used to use but yeah so I loved everything about that video, the class, uh, it helped so much. I would say I wasn't like a beginner when it came to wigs, but there's always room to grow and that just definitely helped. Did y'all see that front that that front of when I lifted up off the off the mannequin? Child boo. It this is about to be I knew it was about to be fire. Like I could tell. I was like, oh, this is a hit. <laughs> but I'm about to go in and go ahead and curl it, style it. You know, I did use my um turn up the heat spray. That is the best to ever use with heat, whether you straightening it. Whether you just blow drying it, even after you style it and just want a nice shine but nothing too heavy on the hair, turn up the heat, baby. It's perfect. But I'm just using a, I don't know how big this, this curling iron is, y'all. If y'all want like a curling video in detail on how I get my curls to the way that they come out, I'll do that for y'all. But yeah, I like to go ahead and curl it and then I, you know, while it's cooling down, I wind it back up and let it sit in the clips, you know? Because I actually didn't put this on until the next day because I had things to do with go off. But the major parts was done. <laughs> so this is the next day, honey. Look at me looking crazy. I came on, you know, just 
looks like my stuff this is how it really goes i hate this part like i really hate getting my ball cap together like it's the most perky part for me <laughs> but uh, yeah go ahead and get that because that's really important and then i'm just sizing up the wig make sure it's good on my ears this wig fit me perfectly i barely had to trim anything around my ears like sometimes and i don't got a big head I need to figure out exactly what my measurements are because sometimes I, I struggle with getting wigs that fit my head exactly. But this is perfect. I had so much room to do my, my uh, sideburns and everything. Like, I was so lit. <laughs> We got all that lace melted. This is what's really gonna turn it up a notch, okay? I get my elastic and I got my scarf, my like scarf, my regular silk scarf, uh, which I didn't get on camera, but I'll go ahead and put that on there fairly tightly, like tight, tight to where it like hurts my ears and gives me a slight headache. That's what I know. <laughs> it's time to take it off. <laughs> But yeah, I can, you know, just, <laughs> I'm gonna try to get some red brows to be with the vibes of the hair. I was feeling myself a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and blend in that lace a little bit more with a little bit of my makeup. Just a little bit, not a whole lot. If you use too much product on the lace, like around the edges or whatever, where your hairline is, it can make it stand out even more. So you gotta use the perfect color and the perfect um, yes. product. Yes. Personally, yes. I don't yes. use yes. 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 like yes. a powder yes. or whatever. Yes. 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 But um, here I am about to just take out all these pins, which is so annoying. But this hair was so nice, y'all. Like, it was so bomb. It was so bomb. I loved it. I love the color. I love the, the way it felt. It's just good quality, y'all. Y'all go make sure you go get your colored wig from I see here because they came through.
I took it on the floor and I was like, pick it up with my foot. But I just kept this part here because I want y'all to see that hairline. Do you see it? Pause so you can see it. Because, <laughs> honey, it's the, I couldn't find the lace for a minute. Okay. <laughs> here I'm just adding a few um, layers. Because um, I really love that look, that swoop look. And then I'm actually going to recurl it a little because it's high that I did um, cut it. It was where I didn't really have any curl. So we're just going to curl it again a little bit. But yeah, y'all, I didn't really show like the complete end product, but I did take photos this day. And yeah, so that's going to be pretty much the finished look. Um, I'm so happy that you guys have came back to my channel for you. You know, a, a updated little wig routine that I do because I do a lot of things, a lot of things more different. But um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you so much for IC Hair for sponsoring this video. Y'all are awesome. I love your hair. I love how y'all work. It's just such a good company, you guys. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.